okay guys uh, in this tutorial we will learn about the transfer function in MATLAB platform first of all we must know that what a transfer function is actually transfer function is just like a stimulus or response of a system when you give any sort of input to it just for an example you can consider a mass attached with that of spring when you apply some force actually you are giving it an input and how the spring mass damper system is responding to your input is its transfer function like when you pull the mass downward and just leave it then it will move into an flow motion or in top and down position so what it actually will do it actually will respond to your input so we can uh, you can say that naturally we can uh, we can convert any physical phenomenon into any mathematical equation so in MATLAB uh, if we uh, want to get a transfer function um, from like uh, any uh, numerator and denominator uh, we can use a command that is TFR transfer function because as we know that in mathematical equations we have uh, one part above the fraction and one part below the fraction line just two part the above part is numerator the, the low the lower part is denominator like uh, uh, we will do one for you that is uh, num is equal to and now here you can also see that uh, here we are dealing uh, with uh, matrices uh, instead of polynomials so why, why why it is so because uh in matlab you should have you, you can you can even write the polynomials but here we are just considering them as the uh matrices so here you can see a matrix with one and two so what is the meaning of it it is actually one x square plus oh sorry it's uh, actually two x zero plus 1x or if, if you can write is like 1 3 and 2 so what it actually means like 2x raised to the power 0 or 3x raised to the power 1 and 1x raised to the power 2 so you can uh, consider them like that so press enter now write denum a is like a 2 3 4 and 5 here we introduce some some more uh, coefficients like uh, 5x0 4x1 3x2 and 2x3 2 x raised to the power 3 so we can press enter now we have both numerator and denominator so now you can write your tran as any variable then write tf tf is actually a built-in uh, function for uh, to get transfer function first write num comma d num num comma d num so when you will press enter you got the uh, transfer function and here you can see that is uh, s raised power 2 3 s and 2 s raised to the power 0 and 2s raised to power 3, 3s raised to the power 2, 4s and 5. So in the it is in the form of numerator divided by denominator because we know that mathematical equation can exist uh, in this form, like uh, one part above the fraction and one part below the fraction. So hope you got some sort of concept. Thanks for watching.